Hi folks, tonight's update I thought I would show the smoke box all neat and pretty. Got it all cleaned up after it got drilled yesterday. You can see the eight holes that will hold the smoke box cover on. There's the smoke box cover. Cleaned up a little bit. <clears throat> Not as good as it will end up being, but and you can see some of the larger holes, the holes that are slightly larger are drilled out an eighth of an inch to um accommodate the 540 fasteners that will go inside the front of the smoke box. <clears throat> Fred came over uh, over the weekend and he suggested, and I like this idea, about building a jig to do the drilling for the rivets. So what you're looking at here, this is an eight, eighth inch thick by three quarter inch wide piece of steel, just ordinary steel I got at the Home Depot tonight. I drilled it over in the mill, half inch from the edge, and then every half inch there's another hole, a number 37 hole. And I countersunk both the front and the back um, to make sure that the holes didn't pinch up as you bend it. And as you can see, I've just bent it around just by hand, no big deal. Gently bent it around the front of the um, the boiler, and that'll give it the approximate arc that I'll need uh, to start to go over to the smoke box and uh, what I'll do hopefully tomorrow <clears throat> or sometime soon clamp this band to the boiler or to the smoke box and then just be able to drill the holes this way I'll I'll have them perfectly spaced a half inch in from the edge and every half inch and then those holes those number 37 holes will be for again pardon me while I twirl around a little bit for these they call these things drive screws. <clears throat> That's what McMaster Car calls them. These are number four by three sixteenths round head stainless steel drive screws. It takes a number thirty seven drill to drill a pilot hole for it. And I don't know if that shows up in there. Yeah, you can see there have the little spiral, not knurling, but uh, spirals cut in them and you just simply drill the hole. I did a test piece tonight over here. I never used these things before so I found a little chunk of aluminum pipe in the scrap box, drilled a bunch of 30, number 37 holes and then tried tapping them in, just gently tapping with a hammer and you know they look like rivets and seem to be quite secure so I'm looking forward to getting those put in it's funny to stop and work on a decorative thing like this right now while I'm so close to getting the boiler installed and you know I'm used to working on cars and street rods and stuff and by the time you install the engine it's um, not long until you get the thing fired up so it's funny to stop and work on a decorative thing but this is the time to do it so that'll be one of the next things to go um, put the uh, the rivets on the on the smoke box and I will keep you posted as I make the updates thanks so much for watching